Hello internet, it is I, the Malik Aaron Aaron, and welcome back to Box Office Predictions. Today we're going to be talking about Audi. So as usual, we're going to be going over the pros and cons, so let's get to it. Pros. Um, this movie has very high reviews. It has a 98%. That's like damn near <laughs> close to perfection, according to... Rotten Tomato standards. Obviously, perfection is a hundred percent, and it's a uh, audience score is an eighty-five percent. So, word of mouth overall is very, very good for this movie across the board. So, yeah, obviously that's gonna be a pro. Um, what genre is this? horror? Mm, trying to think of some other pros. I can't. I can't really think of anything. So we're just going to go to cons. Okay. Big con. No one really knows about this movie. No one really cares about this movie. This movie has no advanced buzz or hype or anything. At least Long Legs last week. That had hype, you know, building up to its release. This has nothing in comparison. So just severe lack of marketing across the board. That's a con. Another con is that this movie, first of all, you already had long legs come out and like, you know, take the box office by storm in a way, opening as high as it did, like the 20 million range. So people are still probably going to be seeing that. They'd rather see that than this. So that's a problem you're going to have, this movie's going to have to deal with, but that's not the only problem. This weekend is all about Twisters. That is the big movie of the weekend. For a lot of people, they probably think it's the only movie coming out this weekend. And from the early numbers, that movie is making a nice bit of cash for itself. And obviously, Oddity is just doomed to be overshadowed. And if that wasn't enough, next week, you got... You have Deadpool and Wolverine, which is expected to be a monster hit, and it's probably going to crush every movie out right now. So, yeah, Oddity is screwed. <laughs> From dealing with long legs to Twisters to Deadpool and Wolverine, it's fucked. <laughs> so, that's a con. An absolute con. Um, I guess looking at... Let's see... IFC films. I mean, they have like, you know, earlier this year they had Late Night with the Devil, which for what it was, did pretty decent. But for the most part, their their movies they don't do well. They don't make really any money. Besides Late Night with the Devil, like what do they have? My Big Fat Greek Wedding, Boyhood. That's really it. So. You know, the, the box office track record, it's not great at all. So, you know, I guess with the exception of, like, my big fat Greek wedding. But that was an anomaly. <laughs> so, yeah. um, So, yeah, IFC films, their box office track record overall, it's not very good. So, that's a con. And... I think that's really it. I don't have much else to say. Yeah, no, no. So, oh, it's a low theater count. I forgot. It's only like less than 800 theaters. So it's not a whole lot of theaters to make money. <laughs> Ideally, you know, more theaters, more potential box office. Like in theory, that's what that's how it works. So less theaters, that's less potential box office. So yeah, that's that's gonna be a con in this case. And okay, so opening weekend less than a million opening weekend and it's total I don't know two two, three mil, I don't know. I there's like a zero percent chance this is gonna pull like a long legs and like shock the world. So yeah, this movie's gonna be one of those that just like it arrives and disappears real quick, you know, which happens to like, which has happened to quite a few movies that I've talked about the this year, 
even if they have high reviews, like if you have like no marketing and no real push to get to theaters, it's not going to last long. It's just not. <laughs> That's just how it is. So yeah, that was Oddity. And now it's time for, you know, the real movie of the weekend. You know, the one the video I'm going to be making after this. Twisters. We get to talk about that. Should be interesting. And then that's it for the weekend. It's nice to have like a kind of like a slow weekend, at least in terms of the number of movies coming out. So uh, yeah, so that's it. That's all. Uh, make sure to subscribe, like this video, leave a comment, turn notifications, share the whole drill. You want to check out more videos like this. I got a playlist on the homepage, all previous um, prediction videos I made this year, the past few years. You want to watch any of them, go right ahead. There's also the canceled series where I went over all the movies that were supposed to come out but didn't. That series is still, you know, still done. <laughs> Never talked about Oddity once because I didn't know it existed until like several weeks ago. <laughs> so I wasn't sure if it would be like a wide release until like the last minute. So, yeah, never talked about it, though. So if you want to watch any of the, the 250 episodes of Cancelled I've made, want to, watch, want to binge them all from beginning to now, I highly encourage you to do that, so go do it. There's also box office recaps where I go over the box office results for a particular month. My July recap, that will be coming out from the beginning of August, between the 2nd and the 9th. That's when it should uh, be that's when I should do it, so unless something happens. So stay tuned for that video. But if you want to watch any of the past recap videos on man the channel, you can go right ahead. And yeah, that's it. That's all. I am out. Goodbye.